Hey, uh, this is Chris Rosano from the band Volcano Choir and Collections of the Colonies of Bees. And I've had a uh, little time to spend with the Zoom uh, G5N. Uh, the nice people at Zoom sent me one of these things. And to be honest, um, I wasn't necessarily skeptical. I was just pretty much uninformed about kind of like an all-in-one pedal amp simulator uh, box. Uh, my rig doesn't use um, a lot of effects like this, but um, I got a Zoom H4n about six years ago. This is like a little field recorder type situation, and I've used it for six years. I use it in all my solo work, documenting ideas, documenting um, band practices and sessions and everything. It's just been um, one of my kind of go-to tools. Uh, for years and years. So when they approached me, I said, okay, I don't know anything about this, but I was so into that device that it was an easy kind of switch. So um, the other kind of challenge I set for myself was I didn't want to read any instructions. I didn't want to think about anything. I just wanted to open it up, start working with it, and hopefully have it, um, have it perform uh, without much effort. So anyway, the G5N uh, totally performed as far as that goes. I opened it up out of the box, I plugged it in, it was super easy. So yeah, it was really easy to set up, the tones are really good. So I kind of approached this pedal from just a total discovery type of situation where I was just, I didn't have any sounds in mind, I didn't have any tones in mind, I just kind of let it lead me through figuring out what it could do. Um, and so some of the stuff that you'll hear from me isn't so much really shredding or playing or anything like that. It's really trying to let the pedal speak for itself and kind of open it up and um, show you some of the maybe different things that it can do. So I don't know. I think that's it. Um, you should grab one. Uh, it was really fun. Zoom's great. Um, again, this is Chris. Enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. 
fun one that's not a uh, sound that I normally play but this is the kind of thing that happens when you have this G5N you can just kind of stumble upon these tones that you would normally not be able to achieve because you don't own any of these pedals um, so I call this one Buzzo because uh, Melvin's are one of my favorite bands um, it, this doesn't really sound like them it doesn't sound like King Buzzo's tone but um, it just reminded me of it so this is distortion uh, octave divider and some delay on the G5N. Uh -huh. 